While the newly crowned champions ACSI celebrate their win at the field, let's find out if this defending champion can retain their title at the Tapaya Sports Hall. This is the National Interschool Netball Championships 2014. Anglo-Chinese Junior College has dominated the leaderboards for the A Division girls title for five years running. They cruised with an outstanding win of 63-36 to over Huachong Institution in last year's championships. Raffles Institution was placed third. The Raffalesians last held the trophy in 2008. With a new team lineup, will RI be able to dethrone the female warriors from ACJC? RI in black and ACJC in white. At the start of the game, RI waste no time in proving their mettle to the defending champions. They're off for a good start as they take advantage of ACJC's sloppy passes to put in the first goal. But ACJC regains their momentum and attempts to stake their claim over the match with a goal by the goal shooter. By the end of the first quarter, RI leads 16 to 13. In the second quarter, ACJC recovers from their slow start to stage swift passes for the ball to reach the goal shooter and level up their game. In an attempt to shake the opponents off, RI builds on their lead to widen the gap. However, ACJC remains hot on their heels and ends the second quarter with just a one-point deficit. In the third quarter, the defending champions turn the game around as they secure a lead over the RI Maidens. But towards the end of the quarter, RI stretches her lead and cruise towards the final whistle with a five-point gap. In the final run for the title race, RI dominates and denies ACJC's intercept to bring their lead further. Their sharp footwork, skillful passing and quick reflexes see them gain a double-digit lead. But ACJC does not give up and breaks through RI's tight defense to put in a goal. In the end, the underdogs show they are a team to be reckoned with as they take home their first title in six years with a 65-55 to 55 win. I think we didn't expect the result. Um, it definitely came to us as a disappointment. Um, but I would say that uh, the finals was uh, really the toughest match we've uh, actually faced. I would say I'm very proud of my juniors because they've actually come too far. But despite the disappointing result, it's okay. I think. Um, they'll come back stronger next year. Like a game of musical chairs, Raffles Institution, Anglo-Chinese Junior College and Hua Chong Institution take the top three positions in the finals this year.